My name is Olli Huttunen, I am from Finland, and I use twin motion to create short films. I have worked at the museum as an audiovisual technician for the past 15 years. Animation, 3D modeling, video editing and aerial photography with a drone are my favorite hobbies. Through them I have participated in several short film competitions. Today I work as an entrepreneur in the audiovisual sector. I was really excited when I first tried Twin Motion. I had been looking for the tools to quickly produce these spectacular images and animations using real-time graphics. Twin Motion was many times easier to learn and produce different environments quickly. And it was also really easy to make these cinematic camera movements in it. Messages is my first short film. It is a montage of different ways we try to communicate with each other. It speaks to our desire to read something that may never reach its destination. Messages is about 95% executed inside the twin motion. But uh, in the most complex animated scenes I have used Unreal Game Engine and some of the details I have also combined and post-processed inside the After Effects. For me, music is the most important part of the whole filmmaking process. When I find such a track that speaks to me visually, I'll take it to my editing program and write very simple sentences about what should happen in the scene. I cut to the rhythm of the music and eventually I get a scripted piece. Then I just start to model and building these sentences into 3D scenes inside the Twin Motion. Because Twin Motion makes it very easy to change the time of the day and play in different weather conditions, mimicking time lapse shots with the Twin Motion has been an interesting project. We all have seen one typical picture, a Milky Way, with a group of radio telescopes rotating on the foreground. I used an image of a Milky Way as a sky dome background, and I got a 3D model of the radio telescope from Sketchfab. I really like the Twin Motion's crowd and the traffic path feature. They give a truly authentic feel. I can create very exciting cinematic scenes that gives the atmosphere of the living city and gives the presence of a big crowd. I also like a weather setting that creates large puddles and makes the ground very wet and allows you to see interesting views from the reflections. I believe that uh, virtual production has already revolutionized the making of the films and TV series. Why not try the Twin Motion or Unreal Game Engine? When you manage to build a simple landscape and start to play in there with a virtual camera, it will surely give you ideas and inspire you to tell something with this media. I think it's worth it and I feel that it's going to be the way of the future to make movies.